Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned in to this UAG Grand Disbursement uh, update, they have come again. Oh. There's another one now moving around. They say they have been around since 2012. Hope Project. And they have been functioning. <laughs> anyway, I leave you. I leave you to listen to this. For me, if you ask me my own opinion, this whole project is fraud. Come on, this grand disbursement of small, small money we are complaining and everything is going wrong. These people want to build houses for widows and retirees. Houses. Do you know the logistics involved? And they already started with story and on story. Anyway, listen to this. If you ask my personal opinion, we have to be careful of this whole project. Listen to this update, guys. See you on the other end. And Ayo, I'm sorry, sir. We just have to call up back on you, yo, because of uh, what we're experiencing here. For you to come and clear the air when it comes to Tuli, sir. Can you hear me, sir? Ambassador Ayo. Hello, my brother. Good evening. Okay. Uh, I want to put uh, Reverend, uh, the legendary Raga Chuku on the hot seat back so that he will. You know, tell you the questions he asked you way back. Reverend, sir, can you hit him with the questions, sir? Oh, okay. You see, what I just uh, want to say in respect to that is that, you know, this, uh, like I explained to him, that uh, this, the piece of this is quite different from that of Grant. It has to do much of a project. But when he was talking about the allocation of uh, funds, the amount to go to each beneficiary per NGO, per cooperative, or per state, per local government, you know, I made it clear that uh, though there is plan for that, but that might not, uh, you know, have been uh, completed, which I know that, uh, you know, by God's grace, like I've stated uh, between the uh, May, June, uh, June, July, when this whole project will kick off, by then, you see, the whole blueprint will be out. Every NGO or cooperative that has, uh, you know, been part of this uh, project, we know what is coming to them then we'll be able to okay maybe they will tell them okay uh, from your place we have a uh, so 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 number of widows and so so number of uh, retirees okay maybe for now we are empowering or we are giving so so number of widows uh, uh each housing unit we are giving so so number of widows this amount you know and also in your cooperative we want to empower uh maybe uh 50 artisans that has to Comprised of uh, five uh, tailor, five uh, bricklayer, five uh, hairdressers, five whichever way I know by then. Even personally, we are still going to call you, you know, and other uh, 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 loyal and uh, transparent uh, people like you that we know in this grand space that we're going to call together, you know, to still give you more details about this so project so that you can have more knowledge about it. And then I know we're going to launch up then and then. Uh, probably bring in the presence of other uh, media, whatever, into it. So everybody will not be able to be sensitized on uh, what we are having at the time. But as it, as it is now, the project is still, uh, the process is ongoing, which we are, you know, rounding up to commence the, you know, the physical development in terms of all these uh, uh, projects now, which will be coming up very soon, like I've said, by that June, July, uh, God's grace. So if you can, if we, we Nigerians can just exercise this little more patience, and give us to then, even by God's grace, God's willing, even before then, you begin to see, you know, the the effect of all this, which I can give you the assurance, like I'm promising Nigerians that God will not disappoint us. Though it is too real to believe, because when we are having a project that is involving housing units, we are still talking about just grants, and the uh, people just to empower people with certain uh, fund that is available is difficult, and we don't even know who to trust. But I can give you that word that by God's grace, this ambassador thank you for people thank god for people who has also spoken you know before me and uh, no matter how we will still have the good uh, the good eggs amongst the bad ones but we pray that god will touch everyone's heart and at least be able to do things right at least for once in this country so please just uh, give us that little time and uh, by god's grace we're going to deliver that was uh, the ambassador uh, are you yeah. from the UN, United States? Okay, uh, Reverend Waga Chukri is back. Yeah, I am a Michael. You see, all this stuff, very sorry, oh, see, 
I'm not spoiling someone's business. But uh, whosoever in this damn community that will not understand what has happened and uh, be careful, I'm sorry for that person. But I don't know about this project, I don't know. But what I'm saying is, based on what he's answering, I don't know if he's the CEO or the spokesperson, but it seems he's the spokesperson. Based on all these things that he's saying, it means they are not ready. Before somebody will carry out a project, he will know how many people in that project. That is how many NGOs. Let's leave about individual. The NGOs. He must have in mind what he or he, the organization has for each NGO. All this thing must be spelled out. Not uh, if it is house housing. You have known that this NGO, you want them to build three houses. Or four houses. Or one. You have known. So if you tell me that you don't know all this thing, that later, very soon as it goes, you, it will be unveiled. It will be unveiled. You know, uh, let me, you he's have, showing, you have, let me, let me conclude. He's showing on seriousness. Before you conclude, before you start, you see, before you start anything again in this country based on this, you must know where you are coming from and where you are going. There is nothing like as we continue, we will now know. No, that has been the pattern they have been using uh, to us. For a very long time. So please, Ambassador, what you will do now is to go back to the drawing board, plan it well, know how many NGO you want to empower from each state, and know how much or the, 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 uh, the amount you want to map out for each in every state. It's very, very important. Then after doing this, when you come out and you will know the specific time or time that thing will last when you deliver. It's yeah, important. Maybe you, get it. maybe you didn't get the point, sir. That is exactly what we have said earlier. But the purpose of coming out tonight is just to, you know, is to debunk and to let people know that what we have is real. It's just, it's not that maybe we are coming out tonight to tell people that, look, we have this. No, we are only on this platform tonight. That's why Ambassador, like, you, Ambassador, don't be angry. Don't be angry. Let me tell you that you came just to debunk that what you are doing is real. That is what I'm telling you. The preparation is not real. Are based on this thing you are saying now. The preparation does not look like real, and that is the uh, problem that people is having. I think now that you come, you now say, Please, this thing is for this amount. We have gotten it. This uh, NGO number of NGO, we have gotten it, and this is the amount that the NGO each NGO will benefit. This is the this is the this is this. And it will be very clear to people, not you, and the bank. And the the reason we said, that's why we said no. the process, this whole thing is no, no, no. The, the, let me tell you, we have suffered so much on process. You needed to put all these things in, in place. Be sure of it before you come out on social media to say that is what I'm just saying. I'm not against you, but I'm telling you why people will be telling you it's fake because it is following the same method others follow. That is what I want to tell you. Please, I'm not against you, but I'm speaking my own mind. Thank you and God bless you. It's okay, sir. No, no problem, sir. Thank you, sir. All right, all right. I think uh, the the man, uh, the ambassador, let me clear it. He just came to replace. Uh, normally, we are supposed to have the CEO, the president of the Tuhi here. Well, he apologized for not having the time to come, so we'll schedule another full meeting for him because he's the best person to give all these answers. Not the ambassador, although uh, the ambassador I uh, just came in from Tuli to just replace uh, the the CEO and the president of Tuhi. So maybe he will not have all the deals or the facts. But I don't know. I don't know, Ambassador. Am I speaking? You know, am I saying the right thing? Or you don't have all you the have, facts? You're very worried. Right. Thank you for that. Uh, all right. For... Okay. So he, he just came. He's not even prepared for this to be on the hot seat. I just told him he has to be on the hot seat. So I think we need to wait for next week when uh, maybe when the president of the two he will come to the hot seat so we heat him up with this question i think i believe he has all the answers for all this stuff anyways uh sir ambassador uh i think you you're giving people the assurance that the two he is real and uh, i saw uh, a petition they wrote against uh, you guys from uh Uyo, that is from a bomb state is it a bomb or somewhere but i saw a petition what do you have to say about that petition I think I saw the write up on the, the platform. Please come again. I saw a petition they wrote against Tuhi in, uh, is it Uyo, uh, Kwaibon State, uh, something like that, one of the Eastern states. What do you have to say about the petition? Okay, you saw it. I saw it. Okay, you don't know about it. You know, You're not you aware know what? of it. You know, you know what? You know what? In the, I think in the recent time, when uh, people were looking at uh, doubting the authenticity of this uh, project, 
I think one some of them, you know, they came together as a body with they wrote not even one petition, a lot of petitions. And I think in the course of that, most of them were able to get the fact that to he, he indeed has, uh, you know, has come to stay and they have been working on uh, several projects, which, you know, will be coming like if it were to be money to, you know, to be disbursed. I think by now, well, everybody would, you know, will have gotten uh, one information or the other. But because it's more of projects, you know, there will be a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of underground work. It's just like somebody who is going to build us and has to go for planning, has to go for getting of purchasing of lands and some other things before you come to you know engineering and allocation uh, of whatever. So that is just uh, I think whatever people are coming up with now is as a result of uh, probably they are doubting you know the project whether it is real or not. But that is uh, what I've come to say tonight and to tell people in this grand ecosystem we are all into it together. We know how much we have so how, how, how long we have suffered, how much we have invested and we have gotten nothing in return. And what you are doing tonight is also as to save us from go falling into more dish, you know, so that then we don't get ourselves, you know, into more more of this uh, kind of uh, whatever and see how to eradicate such. But I'm telling you like I've said, this is a different uh, you know uh, project from the grant, uh, whatever. And I can assure you that, uh, like I've said, you know, and I'm still repeating it, that in no time, all this will become visible. So people will get to see more of what we are saying and why we are saying it is more of projects than uh, grants to be disbursed. All right, straight up, no eyes from the ambassador himself. Uh, I want to know, is there any question for the, uh, for the ambassador? Uh, I'm sorry, Dr. Princess, do you have anything to say to the ambassador? Good evening. Good evening, House. Good evening, House. Good yeah, evening. Good evening madam. yeah. Um, my word stands um, straight this night. Let me come out to express myself and to throw a technical question to the ambassador on seat. Now you spoke that um, Tui is into is into what? Can you come again? Is yeah, into I, housing? More projects, uh, unlike uh, you know where you have to come. with and uh, said we have this number of grants and this amongst a uh, uh, number of uh, NGOs, number of beneficiaries. You know, is a project that is in phases. You know, though there is empowerment. But the empowerment is not like the one we are expecting in in, in, in the grant ecosystem. This is just okay. a, a literally two years on just okay. to support you. Ben, ben okay, ben. let me say this, sir. Let me say this. Um, to me, is into according to you, is into um housing. And then um, projects yeah. from from housing projects from the investigation we got, which is from your head office in Uyo, we are made to understand that empowerment of widows, like you claim, coming up to tell us that uh, the people should um, pay money for tractor, pay money for for uh, for marua they call it marua i don't know what name then pay money for is it um, scholarship and all that is not part of the project so and uh, you made all the ngos to start going up and down opening it letting a uh, an office i mean a um, hall and then you were promising them all manner. And at the end of it, we say they still pay money for processing fee. I hope you are aware of that. I hope, I hope you are clear about that. Am I on course? Ambassador on seat. Please, I want um, a response to that. Mm. I'm trying to pick most of your. So do I... that is what he has been doing all over the 36 states. 
and then we got to understand that like you claim it has been on since 2012 they talk about um uh, uh hajj which nobody has gone to hajj since 2012 and then uh, they talk about jerusalem nobody has gone for jerusalem go to jerusalem since 2012 so another one is coming again this one that is coming is going to prove what he is doing is going to prove it and then um, i am a michael i will want to plead that the director in charge in uyo should be invited into this meeting so that we can it will put more light on some of these things because the petition we saw is showing that every other claim that you added to the agency or whatever housing whatever is not part of their project so how do we go from here how do we go about it after widows have robbed themselves on the floor uh, a, a lot of ngos risk, risk their self going around they paid for registration fee of two hundred thousand. They paid two hundred thousand for registration before you accept them. And the worst of it is that when you get to any 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 of the program place, you the way the artisans will display goods. This same to you. We now we now loot. Let me call it. Let me use that language. Loot. I call it to you. Some of them they rush to borrow money to make, to make presentation just for because they feel the Messiah has come. They display their goods. Then the entourage of uh, to you will not to take it. I will I will want I will want this uh, this chat to be recorded. Let the world know. It's recorded. It's recorded. It's recorded. Uh, 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 so the, 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 the to ye now we now take the sack to pack all what they presented, thinking that maybe in the next uh, three weeks, in the next two weeks, the, the the people will the they will respond to them. Look at it since 2012. This has this has been going on, going on, and going on. Nobody is talking. Everybody is silent. And. The NGOs and the cooperative that took these people out are the ones that they are dragging. Imagine telling them if you want to process a tractor, they have to process it with 100,000. If you want to process a, a, a mar maruba or those... You want to process that of a... Is it some of these things? Hundred thousand to process. The people will start gathering, gathering money through their NGO to submit money to you. So all those things we have to open up to it. And the worst of it again is that anytime the 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 NGOs or cooperative want to take you to a place, they are the one that we book for hotels. You stay in the hotel for three, two or three days in the hotel. With the 15 angel entourage, is the NGO or the uh, uh, and the cooperative that will be in charge of the feeding and all that. So come to spend all this money, and they will be telling stories till now. So this is a good avenue. If you are talking about June, we want to know if June will be June, but before that June. I will want an a clear investigation to Uyo. Let's invite the Tui Capital General to this hot seat. While uh, Alaji Agidi to will be in the hot seat, let there be a clear understanding. Let me put them face themselves. So I will want it that way. Why some other NGO and corporate should be in the chat show in the next um, meeting? Then from there we will know where we are going.
So if they are going to refund the money back to the NGOs, even up to the cloth that that was sewn to his neck, to all the entourage and himself and the and the and the expenditures, then let every NGOs and the cooperative let them begin to make their their accounts now. They should start making the accounts now. Let's present it and take it up from there. So that is just what I will say. Because as it is now, uh, me personally, I hate deception. And the coordinators that are involved, all the coordinators around the country, everybody is angry. And they are pointing fingers. They cannot walk in the street. Pointing fingers at them. What even baffled me is, all the kings, the kings and the 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 oh the kings and the um, uh, widows in different states that was dragged in the mud, and they are holding all their coordinators uh, uh, responsible. There's no, there's no, it's not possible for them to go for to, to organize a meeting like that without contribution. They contributed to 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 make the 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 the, the, the meeting uh, colorful. Then, and at the end of it, they looted their materials and go away. So, uh, I am a Michael. I think, um, and the legendary in the house, uh, they have to look at, look into this, so that the NGOs and the coordinators will know their their stand. So that is just it. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. All right, madam. So, yeah. What you. do you have to say, uh, Ambassador? Okay. Yeah, thank you so much, man. Thank you for your concern. You see, like uh, uh, what I said earlier, man, you have really spoken the, and you have spoken the well, you have spoken the mind of the people. But you see, it's just that, uh, you know, when I was talking, if I should be going into details, into all this, I might take uh, more time because there are more to it. Though when people will give the picture, they might not give it exactly the way it is. But notwithstanding, it is because of the time frame. Like you said, there maybe they will be refunded or they will be given. No, they are, they are, they have not been deprived. Everybody, every NGO, every coordinators, we get, you know, what is due to them, what they have been promised. They will definitely get it, and that is why we are giving that time frame because we know the little process left at least, just because of the new government that just came in, and we know in no time that one, uh, you know, will be cleared. But yet. Um, I will still, like I told uh, uh, Mr. Michael, uh, it's not everything we'll discuss, uh, you know, here on the platform. But I know when you will come to the office, eh, you'll be able to see a lot of things. And you, you'll be able to share lights to so many of these things. The Most of these people that were giving these figures, when some of them just collected this money from their beneficiaries, it's not that they gave to uh, uh, to Baba, uh, to the, uh, to they remitted it to Baba. But for those that were given, directly from Baba, Baba will never deny any of them. And they are all under processing. Like you talked about the, the Jerusalem, the Hajj. They were not, they were, it wasn't that maybe he collected money from them. He gave them. It was a free, it was, it was a compensation that, okay, he gave you this slot, this Hajj slot, he gave you Jerusalem, he gave you this uh, a scholarship. Not that maybe he gave them and he was collecting money from them. No. So that's why I said, with time, when we meet, we'll be able to show show a lot of documents and explain more about this, so that you know that though he has promised, he's going to fulfill, but not that he, he collected or he he, he, he yeah, yeah. I have a question for this ambassador. All right. Uh, the question, Madam, is asking or she ask is emphasizing on the collection of money. If you say you are going to empower a widow and you are collecting... Are you talking, about fulfilling, you talking about fulfilling the promise, sir? Hello? No, he said, did you collect money from widows? Not at all. Not at all. Nothing like that. There's nothing like that. What? Hello? Please, can I come yeah, we, can, we can hear you, sir. That's my question, please. Let him Hello, please, please, can I come in? Mm -hmm. Come in, sir. Abu, Mr. Abu, right? All right, yeah, Hello? thank you very much. I was part of the Hello? program too. Hello, can you hear hey, me? Hey, now? hey, Mr. Hogan first. Hello, Mr. Michael. Come, sir. Let's uh, Mr. Abu finish. 
Hey, hey. All right. Hello, Mr. Matthew. See, I was part of the program too. Hello, please, can I help Yeah, yeah, you? I said, uh, hey, Lusa, hold on first. Let's uh, Mr. Bukhan All right, thank you, sir. See, I was part of the program. I was involved at some stages too, myself. This man in question, fine, he came around, he promised some people some things. The NGOs or uh, the cooperative leaders are the ones that gather people, the beneficiaries. All the widows that they were promised uh, some benefits. He did not collect one couple from any of them. I don't know if the uh, cooperative leader did collect money from their beneficiaries. That is what we don't know. But the man, I'm sure, did not collect one cobble from all, any widow. Even all the houses he promised them, they are going to be fulfilled. It's just a matter of time. And he did not collect one naira from all the widows, the retirees, and anybody. If there is a particular person for all the beneficiaries that they gather at the particular uh, event that the man came for, let them come out. Let them come out and talk that, okay, we go to this man office, so I'm a widow, or I'm a retiree, or all this one, or I, I pay this amount of money to him. Let the person come out, let them bring them out. All right, sir. Thank you very much. So, guys, after listening to this, I think they have come again. This whole project needs to be investigated. A lot, they've started with fraud and suspiciousness. This person say collected money, this person say did not collect money. Building house, building house is he a joke? Is he a joke? The logistics in building house, come on, just disbursement of this small money. We are all there eight years now. Somebody wants to build a house for retirees and widows. We have to look into this whole project. They have come again. So, guys, see you on our next update. We have to be careful in this grand community. A lot of people want to use this grand community to cash out. See you guys.